Welcome to Viking Tools for Revit. In this short example, we're going to look at a new tool called our Cuts and Couplings tool. This has several different functions that we're going to look at very quickly. So with this brings up a new dialog where we can actually come in and cut our pipes, pipe runs into stock lengths of pipe by adding couplings based upon you know your routing tables, how they're established. It'll bring in the proper connections for you. We can cut the pipe, we can join pipe. So if I say cut pipe, for example, to 21 feet, cut that, it cuts us to 21 foot, add a decoupling here. I can also come back here and join that pipe. If I didn't like that location, I can set that. Now, if we look at this in mechanical, another feature of that same option, we can say cut this to a you know, whatever length we want it to be. This needed to be 10 foot 6, for example. Point 0.5 feet. And we'll cut all connected pipes. Everything on that run, everything is now cut into 10 foot 6 lengths. You might do this in the case of having cut pipe into shorter lengths for an elevator. So that is one way to work with that tool. Now another uh, tool that we have, another feature inside this tool, is deleting pipe. Deleting pipe is like convenient when you're looking at building a riser. So I've got a riser stacked here where I've brought in three three of my main components. I've got my pre-action system. I also have a check valve that I need on top of that uh, pre-action and a butterfly control valve for this. This is a group system. So from this point, I will use that tool. And we'll select the delete pipe section. But what I want to do is drop this pipe, or this valve down to connect to this valve here. I'm going to, I'm going to delete this pipe. If I select the top side of the pipe, it'll actually delete the pipe and move this valve up. If I select on the downsides, it'll delete this pipe and move this valve down, which is the case that we're looking for here. So select that, it's now connected. I'm going to do the same process on this. I'm bringing my butterfly valve up so it's connected directly to my valve. And there you have it. So that's a way to very quickly stack a riser, get your components into your, your uh, piping system, your vertical pipe, and then kind of clean it up after the fact. So those are the two main tools that we're looking at in this new tool. So with cutting, all connect pipes, cut pipe, and delete pipe. You have the control of the lengths that you want to work with, a very quick little tool, handy tool to use, uh, a great addition to our library. Thanks for watching.